Behold, the zipper. But where did it come from? Meet Whitcomb Judson, born in 1844. By 1889, Whitcomb Judson was a Civil War veteran and a successful inventor. When he invented the clasp locking system in 1890, he already had more than a dozen patents to his name. Yet it was this invention, which he called the clasp locker, that secured his place in history. It wasn't perfect, but it laid the foundation for what we know as the modern zipper. Patented in 1893, Judson's clasp locking system used a series of hooks and eyes as fasteners. This clasp locker made opening and closing shoes or clothing much easier, but it still had some serious drawbacks. The zipper's journey wasn't over. A scientist named Gideon Sunback improved the design in 1913, replacing the hooks and eyes with interlocking teeth. The U.S. Army was the first big customer, but the clasp locker gained national recognition in 1925, when B.F. Goodrich put the fasteners in a new line of galoshes. These shoes were called zippers because of the noise the fastener made. The name stuck, and the rest is history.